This demonstration will be for band installation on any slingshot with the Ocularis band attachment system. We'll be demonstrating this today on an Axiom Ocularis, but this would be true of any slingshot with the Ocularis banding attachment system, such as the Bean Flip. Uh, an Ocularis slingshot will come with plugs for installation. These plugs already have the bearing inserted. These do not, this is how you will receive them with the bearing not seated in the plug. We will demonstrate it both ways. First you'll want to decide how you want to orient your bands and you'll want to tune them up. These bands have been shortened. These are not the full 10 inches um, to give us the power we want for the animal that we're shooting. So first we're going to demonstrate this in an over the top orientation. So we would put the fuzzy side of the pouch up. That is how our band uh, will be fuzzy side of the band of the pouch up, band going this way. When you're shooting a slingshot, this is the shooter side, this is the target side, so the band will always come up over the top or around the side, whichever uh, orientation you choose. Um, if we're going over the top, then the fuzzy side of the pouch is up, band up. The band will go on top of the slingshot. Do not install the band this way. If you do, your plugs will fall out and uh, your band will not hold. Make sure you get this oriented how it needs to be. The band goes over the top of the slingshot as it is pulled. So the band comes through the target side. Leave yourself some excess here. This will help you uh, manipulate it as you install it and make sure that you have plenty of material in here to grip. Then take the plug and simply insert it into place. Press it in good and deep. Uh, you have some excess here. This is fine. This band is now installed just like that. This is a very, very strong attachment. It will not pull through as long as it is installed properly. We would do the same thing over the top on this side if we use just the plug. It actually will install even easier. It will just slide in. This method is not secured until the bearing is placed inside the ocularis plug. The bearing must be placed inside to expand the plug to fit the ocularis system. You can press the bearing in with your fingers. At this point you will want the bearing installed deeper into the plug. If you cannot get it about halfway in, use something to press it in. If you, if you need um, a pen, retractable pen works just fine. You can take this pen and press the bearing in deeper. But you want the bearing seated deeply into the hole. I'm not going to at this point because I want to take this back out to demonstrate uh, through the forks configuration. So through the forks, installed the same way, just different orientation. Make sure that this is proper. The band always comes through the target side so it can be wrapped around to the shooter side. The plugs when shooting flat bands always go in the shooter side of the slingshot, always. Plug goes in. Seat it deeply. Make sure everything is seated properly. Then around for the other side. Go through the forks. Press the plug in. Make sure you give it a good test. Make sure it's seated properly. Everything looks good. And you are ready to shoot. So the general rules of Ocularis when shooting flat bands. The plugs go on the shooter side. This is the sh side that faces the shooter. The tag end always goes on the plug side. The bands come out the target side, wrap around the frame to the shooter side for a very firm, secure connection. The Ocularis system can also be used in in-between 
orientations. It does not have to be completely through the forks. It can be slightly up in between truly through the forks and over the top. The ocularis system can even shoot uh, two, two sides differently. Some people shoot this way, gives them a different sight reference. The ocular system can be used however you want. So remember to tune your bands to your draw length. Choose over the top through the forks and uh, make sure that your bearings and plugs are seated firmly and you're ready to shoot.